Hey, oh my god, a cutscene. Anyway, let's get this started, am I right? I think you're right. Cool. I am, uh, I guess, I guess I'll do this. I guess my device is in a uh, format or whatever. Pussy. Damn. I never beat this game, but I did. Oh my god, look how many slots you can have. Jeez. Yeah, I never understood why that was a thing. Oh, like, damn. Uh... <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> I, I, but, uh, let's do Sith Warrior. <laughs> three times. But, uh, yeah, right. But, uh, no, I never understood why that was a thing. Because, like, story games like this, like, I understand maybe one replay if you're just like, man, I'm going to go, like, collect all the little things throughout the missions or whatever, like, if you really want to do that. But, well, this, this game has a lot me. of, like, choices, right? I never got very far in this game, but you can sort of do a lot in this game, right? Not really. It's oh. A, it's a story you find. Oh, I thought you could kind of pick whether or not you're good or bad. Am I wrong? I don't think so. Do I, am I going to look like an idiot on my own show? Dude. James, you better not make me look like an idiot in front of my uh, on, on my own show. Uh, he's yelling, he's very distracted. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> oh, yeah, I hear that. Well, we're going to Kashyyyk, yeah. so that's pretty epic. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, James, did you, did you always watch the cutscenes as a kid? Yeah, no, I watch, I still do that. I, oh. for, for certain games, it, it really depends. Like, uh, I don't know, like, like the Far Cry games, I, I watch all the cutscenes and stuff just because it's like half the fun is kind of following a story because you're like, oh shit, like what what goes on here? Yeah, yeah, I, I, uh, it was a big source of contention between me and my brother because he, I, I loved the cutscenes and he was like, I don't really care, and I was like, oh. So then I would always plead with him. I was like, please, oh, please, can we watch it? And he was like, no, let's start the actual game. And uh, I was like, oh, and I always would get really mad. I'd be like, what happens, dude? Why are we here? Yeah, but you know what's cool about playing video games by yourself is that you can watch whatever cutscenes you do or do not want to watch. Yeah, I mean, unless the game doesn't let you skip them. Yeah, that's then, true. Then if you don't, kind of like, fuck you. Although, yeah, you know, weird. I love the... Unskippable cutscenes are really annoying to me. Even after all yeah. that. Yeah! You know, where it's like, yeah, yeah I mean, sometimes, though, yeah, like, now I get it. As, as a man, you know, as a, as a guy with things to do and my time is precious. I, I get... Right. What? Is this, uh... What are these little icons? Sorry, I, Which, I really... Oh, in the corner? Yeah, oh, when I, I hit You're like force power. When you're, so I... when you... No, I think it's the D-pad. I'm hitting the D-pad. I think nothing's, it's the D-pad. Nothing's doing anything. Oh, I'm maybe just destroying it's, it's, wildlife. Whatever X, Y, X, Y, A, and B. Then. Maybe? Like, maybe if you oh, press well. that and then... Oh, I guess I threw my yeah, lightsaber. Could... Yeah, that's... Because I could uh... see the left one is the lightsaber throw. Oh. And then I think the other one's a force choke. Oh, I think it's just that little oh, no. thing. Okay, uh, sorry yeah. gamers. I'm, I'm, I have to relearn this game. I think a lot of the video games make, like, the use of the Force a lot cooler sometimes than than the movies did. Oh yeah, definitely. You know, like, playing just, this game, you're like, wow, why wasn't this blue, in the movie? It's right, amazing. like, when he shoots, like, a blue dust of, like, smoke and it sends you fucking flying or whatever, like that, like, or, I guess not smoke, like, plasma, or whatever the fuck it is, but it just, you know, just force fucking push and you see just this big blue wave and shit. I think that's just so much cooler than, you know, that they're like, oh, <laughs> just kind of flying back. <laughs> yeah, I mean, when, when you, I think in this game, or maybe it's the second one, oh, I got an achievement, how about that, guys? I'm a I'm a good gamer now. Whoa, he fell. Did he trip over you? Like what? 
You were What's a total that mess game? Of it's like uh, it's an online game where you can like be a Jedi and do Jedi shit and whatever. Uh, you know, and that, it was like a big big MMO. I have no idea. But you can like grab Tie Fighters out of the air and like throw them at a clone uh, trooper, or I guess they're stormtroopers at this yeah. point. And it's just like, oh my yeah. god, it's freaking yeah, awesome. Why weren't they just doing that? Just, uh, just dropping ships? No, but I mean, um, no, they did like in the trailer for that game because I never actually played the game, but the trailer did that was just so intense and just showed all this stuff you could do with the force. And I'm like, man, I didn't see that shit in the movies. Why not? <laughs> Yeah, right? Uh-oh. Okay, there we go. It's cool being Darth Vader, but he sure is slow. No, yeah, that's kind of the trade-off with him. Darth Vader yeah. is kind of a not so tanky tank. I mean, that's true. Yeah, I definitely understand why he is, because of his whole uh, robo-legs. But this is a game. I want to do what I want. Yeah, Darth Vader game. should sprint. That'd be pretty sweet. I mean, in, uh, like, the original Star Wars Battlefront, they kind of, like, you can kind of use them to, like, float. Oh, my God. Where were these Wookiees in Episode 3? These guys are crazy. The Wookiee Warriors? Yeah, they're so awesome. Do you see that guy, like, yeah, lunged I mean, at me out of nowhere? Yeah. Yeah, no, that's true. I mean, I, I don't know. Yeah, that's a, again like in the movies. It seems like something that they like kind of showed you, or maybe hinted like, yeah, like this is what goes on in this world. But it wasn't like a whole thing for like, yeah, viewers, look at this shit. Isn't yeah. this cool? And I kind of wish it was more like that. Oh, snap! I can just pick someone up and toss them around like a paper plate. Oh, I'm getting a hit though. I gotta toss him like a couple So not very far, because it just kind of goes like, oh, and then hits the floor. <laughs> well, I guess I should have said maybe like a frisbee or something, but I was just, that was the first thing I thought of that was like really light. <laughs> yeah! Come on. Uh, come on now. I'll do this all day. Come on. Okay, never mind. Okay. Yeah, I think you have to like press block as they're shooting at you to hit them directly back. Probably. You know what I mean? Yeah, it probably does require some amount of skill. Whoa! Okay, not that way, I guess. <laughs> do you think, um, even though he's all serious and moody and, you know, full of anguish, uh, do you think he's still kind of like running a little thing in his head of like, oh, okay, I guess I can't go that way because of the TIE Fighter. Where he's just like, huh, Wookiees, huh? Hmm. <laughs> just like really like stupid internal monologue kind of stuff of like, huh, it's actually yeah, kind of like, cool here. He probably, yeah, like he probably doesn't give a shit that, you know, the TIE Fighter thing just crashed through the bridge. If anything, he was like, this inconveniences me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's just kind of like, huh, you know what, maybe I should make a fortress here. This is a pretty sweet, uh, little island. <laughs> oh my god. No, no, James, you're a, you're a, I think it's fair to say we both are big fans of Star Wars. Oh my god, yeah, dude. Ha have you seen I was episode explaining 9? Of course, yeah. Oh, I have not seen oh, yeah. 9 yet. Oh, it was a, uh, it was, so, I've seen like, some I clips, think, and it just I mean, seems like a clusterfuck. It is, but, like, I, I think what I may have discussed before is kind of, like, I'm not the biggest fan of, like, where they went with the sequel trilogy. Like, I yeah. was just disappointed because all the, like, a lot of the theories that I heard sounded more promising than what they went with. <laughs> yeah. Um, I guess also, Dude, get back here. something about, like, like episode eight was like um like a lot of the work was done by someone different or something you know like someone different went in like did some shit and that's why the story starts to like go somewhere but then yeah. they brought someone back yeah originally jj abrams i think was supposed to do all of them 
And then, for whatever reason, um, they got Ryan Johnson to do eight, and he was basically like, well, I don't really want to do any of the stuff that, like, was set up in seven. Right. So I'm just going to basically forget it and retcon it. And then when that didn't do well, they were like, well, we need JJ back. And then J.J. Abrams was like, well, I want to finish the idea that I had, so now I have to kind of retcon the movie that retconned my ideas. And um, it just kind of... It's really just a wreck on the viewers. Yeah, it really just... You know, I, I was what saying this... Uh, I can't remember to who, but, you know, say what you will about the prequels. It was... It was uh, George Lucas's vision, and you can definitely see, even in the uh, the originals, that it's like someone's. Right. It's a beginning, middle, and end. And again, I, I right. haven't seen and nine, it, but project all the way through, right? Yeah, I don't think anyone ever considered. Um, oh, we're gonna do a Palpatine clone. You know right. what I mean? Like, I just don't think that was ever in the cards, and. Uh, I don't know. I never. Oh, not a clone. I. I thought it, I thought they announced like clones and stuff. No, he got revived. How? Because he... it it was in the it was in the books too, um, and but... then some of the comics as well. He got like. Uh, it, I mean, they do it differently in there, but I there's, don't know. There's it's some, some line shit though. Do, of course. There's like a line though. Of he's like, What's oh, that? I've I've lived a lot or like I've lived many times or something like that will this guy just die already well right cause he, he like revives himself through the force and stuff cause of the whole like conversation he had in episode 3 where he was kinda like if you access the dark force like long, like you can literally cheat death oh I, I guess I was yeah. just I, again I've only seen some clips on YouTube so maybe my knowledge is uh is lacking but I don't know. It's well, all right. stupid. But, yeah, I thought with the with the ninth though was that it was a really good conclusion to uh, a somewhat disappointing storyline. You know what I mean? Like it was, it was like for what they had going on. Like I thought That's they cool. did a good job wrapping it up. That's fair. But yeah, I just wish they had done something different overall. Yeah, I heard uh, the last season of Clone Wars uh, has been really, really good, but I don't have Disney Plus, so I can't watch it. Ah, oh, shit, dude! I, I'm still not even like I. I used to watch that shit all the time. I still I gotta like rewatch it and catch up. That doesn't sound like James Earl Jones. Is that me? That's you. I don't think James Earl Jones did this one. That's a disappointment. Yeah. Man, Star Wars is full of that. Wouldn't it be amazing if the little kid just killed Vader? Yeah, and, right. And, and, the, right <laughs> and the original movies never happen. Oh, shit. Straight up mutiny, but like not because it's the boss I'm killing me. the workers. Oh, yeah, that's true. I guess. Yeah, I guess that's not really mutiny. That's just taking charge. No, that's just turning your back on your previous ideas that's just a gorgeous transition oh fuck yeah it is <laughs> <laughs> fuck yeah and isn't it isn't it, this what kind of bothers me about prequels and and stuff like that where um is Vader's whole thing in this that he's like, okay, we're gonna take, o we're gonna kill the Emperor? Uh, yeah, that's like what the whole game's about. It just seems strange to me because, I, I, unless it's resolved in this, but it's like he didn't really seem like that kind of guy in the original movies. He seemed like pretty complac complacent, you know, up until the very end when he's like, oh wait, my son needs me. Yeah, I mean that's kind of the idea. Like he wants. Like, he has a different motive in this game than the movies. Because, oh. like, the whole goal the whole goal of the Siths is to eventually kill their master. Like... Yeah, because there can so, only be the two. There's the whole rule of two thing. 
Well, right, but even even the rule of two, like, you know, they the end goal for a Sith is to eventually become the master, and so they by doing that they have to kill their own. You're right because the thing of two, they have to kill their own master. Oh, okay. And then, there then they take on an apprentice and stuff, and that's why this whole game, you know, like with the whole rule of two and shit, it's like that's why he's an illegal apprentice. Ooh, who is? And he kind of just. Yeah, your your character, it's like it's against the rules. Right, right, gotcha. I don't and know. Like, I, again, I I never beat this game, um, so maybe they explain it. But I was like, where was where, they, where is this coming from? I mean, yeah, they do. I mean, if you're like really paying attention to everything they do, but it's also like just kind of known about Star Wars. Well, yeah, for sure. Sure. But just I just mean character wise, yeah. like. Oh no, I, I totally get it. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm saying there are, there are certain things where it's just kind of like you use your previous knowledge of Star Wars to. Yeah, no, of, I get that he's like an illegal like, thing, little boy. Right. Do you think he right and the robot though in the girl form kiss? Did Vader tell you that he killed our last pilot? The robot in the girl. Because the robot can shapeshift? Gave Lord Vader good reason to do so. I mean, I guess it's always possible. So I'd like to think they do. Pilots. What have you done to my ship? I'm sure there's some sick fuck fan fiction about like a shapeshifting robot. That now you'll be able to spy just kind of that was all we need to do. This isn't fan fiction, James. This is reality. It, it was on the screen. You don't need to know anything about my missions except where they didn't I'm going. Kiss. I need to jump to Narsha. <laughs> they they ain't. Yeah, that. you're right. <laughs> of course. You could even see her little titas bounce. Oh, look at that eye roll. They have chemistry. Mm -hmm.